Hey guys, it's Ellie J. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a River Island haul and lookbook. So I made a little order off River Island off their plus size range because I didn't actually know that they did one. And I actually ordered some items, as you can see here. And you can see here. So, so let's get straight on into the video. So with these outfits, I decided to order what was styled on the model on the website. So all the outfits that I'm going to show you today are all styled by River Island themselves. So I've got seven outfits in total today. One of them is not styled. One of them is just another top that I really liked. So we're going to compare them and see how they look. Expectation versus reality. So the first outfit I got consisted of these two items. It is a bodysuit and some... I want to say palazzo pants cutlets that's what it is so the pants are all black i'm just going to take them off this hanger they are a gorgeous material they're kind of like crepe they're quite heavy they are very long so i am going to wear a pair of heels with these just to see but these are what they look like i ordered a size 18 they've actually got pockets which is a massive bonus so on each of the pockets they've got three small little gold rimmed buttons they look really comfy, I'm not gonna lie. They feel really nice material, they feel really good quality. And again, they are high waisted. So the top to this outfit was this bodysuit with this absolutely amazing pattern. This is also a size 18. So it's just a standard uh, bodysuit. Yeah, it's pretty square along the top, so I don't know how it's gonna do in the boobage department, but we will see. It feels quite breathable. Just, I love the pattern of this. It kind of reminds me of the River Island logo a little bit. Um, if you tipped it upside down, probably. I don't really know what I'm talking about, but I absolutely love this gold detailing. The other thing I will say are these straps aren't adjustable, so we'll have to see how that is, because obviously it could depend on how big your boobies are. But we'll try it on. This bodysuit is so, 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 so comfy. I didn't think it would be because I don't normally get on with bodysuits a lot, but this was so stretchy and just really breathable. And I thought the straps would be a bit too small, in a sense. I thought they'd be a bit too tight. They weren't, they were the perfect length. The bodysuit out of five, I would definitely give this a five out of five stars. As for the pants, they were actually really light to wear. They were really nice to wear. They were really comfy, but they weren't too heavy. You can pull them up quite high, so if you're into more high-waisted stuff, you can definitely do that with these. They are a gorgeous pair of pants as well. Plus, they have pockets, so if I had to rate these out of five, I would definitely give these a five out of five too. So, the next outfit I'm going to talk about is this white top, which is a blouse. I think it was advertised as a balloon sleeve um, cross blouse or something like that. It was something blouse obviously because it's a blouse um it's white it's a gorgeous gorgeous material it is very low cut so i don't know how i'm going to get on with that in the front it actually comes up a little bit and then down so as you can see it's cut to kind of come just above your waist so this top was styled with these blue jeans from river island these are called the kaya jeans they're a high rise disco uh, they're a lovely 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 rich blue color just your normal denim so these jeans actually feel really good quality to be honest i'm not a massive jeans wearer i, I struggle to find jeans that fit me very well because my with me jeans tend to be either too long on the legs and too small on the waist or too small on the waist and too long on the legs so we'll see how we get on with these This outfit is so nice. <laughs> I feel so, so nice in this outfit. These two combined are so, so nice. I was quite intrigued as to where this top would actually come to on me because obviously it was cut short at the front and the back. I absolutely adore this top. This top is gorgeous. As for the jeans, the jeans were also really comfy. I didn't think that with them being so tight that they'd be that comfy, but they actually are. They're really stretchy, really, really nice material, and I couldn't recommend these enough. And they fit both on the waist 
and the legs. So that was outfit number two, now on to number three. So outfit number three is this gorgeous light blue pastel-y bardo jumper. It is quite long but this is kind of a thin wool. I'm not sure if it's real wool but it is quite thin and it's a knitted material. So these are the black jeans that I purchased. These are the Molly, oh they're not actually jeans. I did not realise. These are the Molly jeggings. Obviously with these being jeggings hopefully they'll be a bit more stretchy. Then again the blue ones for being jeans and jeans are not normally as forgiving as jeggings. They were really nice and they were really nice. So hopefully these will be quite similar and just as comfy. This bardo jumper, this bardo jumper is the coziest thing I have ever worn. Granted, I was kind of melting a little bit because it is a light knitted material and I did know that. And it is summer at the minute and it's been very hot today. I know, Britain, hot, surprise, I know. It's really light to wear, but it is warm enough. So you could definitely wear this in winter and autumn, even on a colder day in summer. To be honest, you could get away with this because it's off the shoulder as well. It's quite open in a sense, it's not all enclosed so you won't be absolutely sweating your socks off. It is quite long, um, this is an 18 to 20 so obviously it has to cater to people both a size 18 and a size 20 but it was no problem for me I just kind of tucked it up a little bit. As for the jeans, these are so nice. These jeans again fit me both on the waist and on the legs. They are equally as comfy as the blue ones. Now outfit number four was also a style with the black jeans so it's just a top that I'm going to show you guys this time. So this is a button up animal print blouse. It's quite a silky material, it feels really light and really airy and it's actually got ties at the bottom as well so you can button it up and tie it and the sleeves I have just rolled up because it's more my style. opinions on this top again love it this top is so light and airy it felt like i was wearing nothing i was wearing this this looked really nice with the black jeans um the black on the black really really contrast well river island are killing it with these clothes so the next outfit is actually a jumpsuit so this is all black it's got this gorgeous diamante um buckled belt so we're gonna see how that looks and then the legs are just the legs are just um, flow right a little bit, so let's go and try this on. So, I normally get on quite well with jumpsuits. Um, they're something that I can wear quite easily and flatter my body shape quite well. This is one of them. The plain black with just the simple belt buckle, it looks so elegant and so, 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 so nice. It's so comfy. So outfit number six is actually the one that wasn't styled on the model. This is another top that I found, which I really, really liked. I find it quite oriental. I think that's kind of the best word to describe it because the pattern almost reminds me of cherry blossom, the colouring and things like that. I'm going to style this with the black jeans just because obviously the black background and I think that'll be the most fitting. This is the perfect top for summer. Honestly, so light, so breezy, so comfy, and so, so, so flattering. The high neck, I wasn't too sure of. I don't tend to wear high necks, um, but this is a really nice high neck. So guys, we're on to our last outfit. Mm, this is outfit number seven. This is a boiler suit. So obviously, like I said earlier, I get on really well with jumpsuits, but I've never actually worn a boiler suit. So this is a full sleeved and full legged boiler suit. It's also got these two small belts as well so with these cute little buckles. So that'll kind of cinch you in at the waist a little bit. So I can't wait to try this on. I've never tried a boiler suit before.
opinion on boiler suits. I love them. This is so comfy to wear. It's honestly such a nice piece. You can either dress this up or definitely dress this down. The belt detailing I absolutely love because it's quite dainty. This is gorgeous and definitely one of my favourites from today. And again, River Island, stop killing it with all these plus size pieces. So guys, that is everything tried and tested. I am so 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 impressed by everything that i've worn today i thought there'd be a couple of little flops because there always is when you're trying on different clothes and especially when you've ordered them offline you don't know what you're getting and sometimes sizing can be a bit of a problem but everything i ordered today was a size 18 apart from the jumper which was an 18s to 20s and the sizing has been consistent accurate and i am very 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 impressed the quality of these pieces that i've tried on today has just astounded me and if i had to rate river Island Plus as a brand uh, out of 10 for the quality and accuracy of their products definitely a massive 10 I could not recommend it higher enough and today's video isn't sponsored I bought everything with my own money so that is everything for today if you enjoyed it please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below if you're new and I will see you all in the next one see you later Thank mm -hmm. you.